Alright Mavericks fans, welcome to the third preseason game for the Mavericks tonight. They're starting up to a very rocky start to the season. They're 0-2, although it is a preseason. They're taking on the Indiana Pacers, who will be without Paul George for the remainder of the year. They're 1-1 one one in the preseason, so it should be a good game. Tonight we expect to see the first action of the new season from Dirk Nowitzki, who has not played the first two games. Out is going to be Raymond Felton, who may miss up to 10 games, and Monte Ellis should miss the next two games as well, too. So we'll be a different Mavericks team. But we will see Dirk and Chandler Parsons for the first time together on the floor. I'm excited to see what that how that happens. Now, let's go back to the action real quick. We'll take you guys inside for the Dallas Mavericks. All right, Mavs fans, you're going to get a chance this season to follow me, Rodney Fisher, throughout the entire Mavericks season and watch me lose weight with the help of DownsizeFitness.com. Make sure you check them out at DownsizeFitness.com, 469-206-3756. They've got two locations in the DFW area, one by the Galleria Mall in Dallas and also Hearst. So check them out, Downsize Fitness, 469-206-3756. Let's go to the Mavs action. All right, Mavericks fans, we're here at the Mavs with their very first win tonight, 106-298 over the Indiana Pacers tonight, their first win of the preseason, now with a 1-2 record. But more importantly, they had six guys in double figures. And, of course, Dirk Nowitzki returned to the court, 16 points tonight. Five rebounds and two assists. That's here from Coach Carlisle on, his, on the return of his superstar, Dirk Nowitzki. You know, he said, uh, he told Casey that he felt good out there. So those are good signs. Uh, it's really just a beginning for him in terms of live action, as we all know. I mean, he played some live stuff in practice the first week, but since the fan jam, I mean, he really hasn't been in any live play. And so um, it's a big week coming up for him and a lot of these guys. Uh, we got a few practice days here, so we got a lot, a lot to get done, and we got to get healthy. All right, it was Coach Carlisle talking about the return of Dirk Nowitzki. Now let's go into the locker room real quick. Hear from Chandler Parsons and also Dirk himself. It is surprising that we came here and about that. No, that's what kind of guy. Seems like you and Tyson are getting in a real good groove in the pick and roll. How dangerous can you two be? Yeah, it's it's good. Uh, you know, he's such a he sets such good screens and he rolls so hard. Where you know the big guy has to make a decision where he's going to cut me off and not let me get to the basket or or stop me. And that's where I can find Tyson or find shooters. So I'm very comfortable with the ball in my hands. And I like making plays for others more than I like scoring. Do you pick up a lot of Twitter and Instagram following? Uh, you know, I probably could have played a lot already last game. Since it's preseason, we took it slow with, uh, with the hip and uh, felt fine. It felt fine moving. Um, just, uh, you know, just better keep on working. Uh, put in a couple more plays and uh, some defense rotations, but uh, it was already better, I think, than the first two preseason games. What's it like being out there with Chandler for the first time? You just had that on Twitter, bro. It was fun. Uh, you know, just uh, he's, he's after uh, he finishing the rim and brings all the stuff that uh, we need him to bring. So it's been it's been fun. And, you know, uh, can't wait to have Monte back. Obviously, is a big part of what we do. And uh, so uh, Raymond doesn't look good. You know, I think he's going to be out for a minute. So uh, the ball handlers are a little. Uh, a little tough to come by now with, uh, with just basically Jameer and Devin. Uh, I think we all had a good game today, but uh, we started big at the two and three, so hopefully uh, Dante and Kelsey. With three new starters, do you feel like you guys need us? All right, that wraps up everything for us for the Mavs video recap. Make sure you guys stay tuned for more Mavs action. Thanks to uh, Downside Spenders for making this all possible. Until next time, make sure you check us out on rfsportsradio.com, and we'll see you at the next Mavs game.